Hey, I'm here to talk about the Roxy Journal of Stitchery that I'm going to be uh, partaking of come January, I believe is when um, uh, Rachel and Sarah of Roxy Creations will be doing their Journal of Stitchery Challenge for 2022. And um, so far they have had us make our book and our pages and our signature. I believe they are using, Rachel and Sarah are both using the cover of a book for their journal, um, but I didn't really have a very good any good books. So I am going with a technique that I learned in Wendy Selganik's Willa Wanders or Willa Journal um, class, which is to use, I forget if it's called Pelon or Peloton. I think it's Pelon. Anyway, I use some Pelon and I, used the, I wrapped it in this um, uh, upholstery fabric, which I've had forever, and I have been dreaming of making a journal with it. So I used that and my very first binding ever, which is, you know, okay if you don't look too closely. Um, but so this will be the journal, uh, and I will bind the signature in here, the signatures in here. Um, also from the Willa journal class, uh, I learned about making signatures from painter's drop cloth. So that's what I'm using for my signatures. And I just essentially hemmed them with an invisible hem uh, so that I can fray them a little bit, but they won't keep, they won't continue to fray. So hopefully I'll have nice frayed edges. The pages are made out of this, are going to be made out of this linen. Um, and some I have made like quote unquote double spread uh, and uh, hemmed them. And here's some single pages hemmed. Some of them I left raw and just did that invisible uh, hem and I'll fray them a little bit and leave them raw. And there's some um, double pages there too. So I'm just starting my sampler now um, I believe that Roxy, I'm sorry, that Rachel and Sarah have put up all the videos for various stitches that we'll be using in the journal. Uh, so I've started on my sampler and we'll continue to work on that so that I will be ready to go in January.